So let me show you what I was doing with the thumb pick, which I think you might find interesting. Thumb picks can do some cool stuff, but if you have lots of strings to play, you can pick a lot of different sounds. I'm just using that thumb pick and kind of making a cool uh, picking pattern that I'm following around with those different open tune, open um, string chords, and then ending up with the G major because that's kind of how the song, the tune that I'm working on, just resolves, seems to resolve to a G G major chord, which means it so that it sounds complete. If I don't play that G major chord, it you it leaves you hanging, which might be what you want depending on what the song is, but. That's what I'm doing there is I'm using the G to resolve that, that tune. So you, you can hear the E minor. And it leaves you hanging if you stop there. It's like, where's the end of the song? So if I go... It sounds like it completes the song. So that's, that, that's the idea there. I'll use the G occasionally with the full bar chord. Not playing the fifth string. Just the 6, 4, 3, 2, 1 with the picking pattern. So this picking pattern, I'm using a, a pick. Remember the Herco? 52 pick, and I go like this, I go, I pick five and two together. So it's five, two together, four, three, five, two, four, three, five, two, four, three, five, two, four, three. Five two together four three five two four five two together four three five two four five two together five two together four three five two four five two together four three five two four five two five two together four three five two four and then occasionally I'll switch my my third finger in on that first string so. might even pluck it together with the 5-2. So instead of saying doing the 5-2, which is what I was showing you a minute ago, now I'll go and pick it 5-1. So it would be 5-1, 4-3, 5-2, 4-5-1, 4-3, 5-2, 4-3. That's not right. 5-1, 4-3, 5-2, 4-5-1, 4-3, 5-2, 4-3. Five one four three five two four five one four three five two four five one four three five two four like that. So I switch it off. So I go five one four two five one four three five two four five one four three five two four and switch back five two four three five two four five four five five two four three. And you can even throw in the bass if you want to. But then I get lost a little bit. So you can play around with that pattern and just once you practice that, you need to practice that picking pattern just really slow on a tempo that you can you can follow. If you have a metronome, use that until you get it down. And you can once you get it down and you can play like nine times straight, you can go faster.
that's uh, the lesson. Thanks.